you found them on. If we hurry, there may still be time to save the mayor. The mayor's gonna die. Mm -hmm. I know he is. Come now, mayor, you must take this. It will make you better. Oh, I feel so dizzy. I was wrong, he doesn't die. At least not of sickness. The mayor's better now. Okay. Thought for sure he was gonna die, but nope. Aww. Oh, quite a strange looking. You have no room to talk, sir. <laughs> what brings you to our beautiful city of Abydos? The sacred crown of Abydos for Anubis. Hmm, that is indeed a significant request. He is lying, sir. He's the imposter who poisoned you. He wants to steal the crown. Anubis would never consort with such a creature. Don't trust him. Who wants to bet that's the guy who poisoned them? Oh, yeah. Silence, you leeches have been seeking the crown ever since you joined the council. Yep. This sphinx has already proved himself more trustworthy than you. The difficult decision requires some deliberation. Why is everyone so interested in the crown these days? I must think the best course of action. Sphinx, join me next door in a few moments and I will inform you of my decision. He's a bird. More specifically, he's a pigeon. Why was Hello. I a walking pigeon? The city of Abydos hails you as a hero, my friend. Thank you, sir. Things get more buff. I know, right? Who knows? Hello, sir. Fine. Why is everyone going to be like that? Why did he open the blinds? That's so bright. Oh, Here we go. Above all, the people of Abydos express their sincerest thanks for the good deed you have done for this city. But... Our fair city has been going through a most turbulent time recently. It seems that some higher power is determined to bring misfortune and misery to our lives. Yeah, that's fair. Your arrival and heroic actions have been like a ray of hope to the people of Abydos. Aww. Thus the council have decided that the sacred crown of Abydos will be entrusted to you. Aww, thank you. On the condition that you deliver it safely to our Lord Anubis and express our warmest regards to him. Very well. What? You cannot give him the crown. He is clearly an, an imposter. Anubis would never endorse the actions of one such as he. I think he likes me more than you, sir. The crown is ours. You're not going to give it away to anyone, you stupid fool. Now we get to have a fight. I oh, bet. Yep. Come, brother. The crown is ours. As for you, Mayor, your short-sightedness has secured... City once and for all. Ah. Blah, blah, blah. The traitors are escaping. Please spank sign. For you, retrieve, retrieve the crown. crown. Slow down. A third Sphinx level now. I bet this is just a big fight. Probably. Ah. Yep. I bet this is also going to be a puzzle fight. I must admire your persistence in jeopardizing our plans to steal the crown. Yes, we electrified the water. Yes, we stole the museum's jewels. Yes, we poisoned that childish mare. They're working with but everything has space. indeed been worthwhile. Behold this magnificent object that our Lord of Darkness is so intent on retrieving. Ah, servants of 
Anubis and his foolish minions, such as yourself, are insects in comparison to the glory of the great god Set. Of course. Of course. He deceived the people of Luxor with his cunning, and soon the castle of Uruk will cast its shadow over all lands. Look at his army, if you can call it such. Ha ha ha, this is all he could muster to retrieve the artifact? Pathetic. Oh. Oh. Dad, do you want the controller? Oh, great. Thanks. <laughs> well, look up how to beat it, because I bet you it's a puzzle battle. Insignificant little creature, you cannot stop the apocalypse that runs parallel to Set's destiny. I need apocalypse. No. You will not live no. to understand the power of this crown. Prepare to die. Okay. Battle skeleton bird. Oh, what the frack? What Whoa! The frack? What the frack? Okay, would you like to pause the game real quick so I can read this? Yes. Start off by luring the bird's fireballs into the solid stone pillar surrounding the crystal. Right. These are actually laser focal points which are necessary to defeating the beast. Bird has primarily two different attacks. It will shoot giant fireballs, which can hurt upon impact, and also act as landmines on the ground. You also have to worry about a tremendous wind attack that can blow you up the center plateau. To avoid the wind attack, let's see, run into the wind and do nothing else. Don't swing a sword or jump. Simply run head straight into the wind. Okay. It should keep Sphinx's location stationary. Now, once all four pillars have been knocked off, strike the targets aside, get all four lasers to point at the crystal, and a huge beam will blast upwards. Ah! Hit the bird with this huge beam three to four times for defeat. I'm not even entirely sure I can make it back to the battle, because when he does that wind attack, it'll Close. knock you off of this. See? Woo! So obviously, you must wait before jumping. No, you... I guess get up here? Say? He's got to stop eventually. Okay. Okay. Just run straight into it and you'll hold still. Yeah. My thumb slipping. And direct his fireballs towards those four pillars. Ah! He missed! Woo! Okay, there's two. One more. You're slowly running out of light there, Frank. Yes, I know. May I suggest getting behind it instead of. Oh, good point. It. Okay. Now, what do we do? Okay. Bird has primarily two different attacks blah, blah, blah. See, to avoid the wind attack, run up to the wind, don't swing sword jumps. Let's see. Once all four pillars have been knocked off, strike the targets inside. Get all four lasers to point at the crystal. Ah, I get it. Three. Four. Got it. He's dead. Except that. No, he's not. Okay, no, let's see. Do I have to do it again? Yeah, hit the bird with this huge beam three to four times for defeat. Okay, got it again. Mm -hmm. 
One. Two. Three. Four. No! 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 It's okay. It's probably going to let you start where you left off. Yeah, the crystals are still crystals and not pillars. Oh, thank you. But I've only got one bar of health left. And I've got to make it back down to the battlefield. I'm sorry, Mom. Did we wake you up? Yes, we did, didn't we? Uh -huh. No! No! <laughs> One, two, three, four. He's not dead, is he? He's not dead. Once more, then. One, <coughs> two, Three, four. I think we got him. Is he dead? Yeah. Um. No. He's not here anymore. He certainly isn't. What happened? I don't know. One. Ah! Two. Three. That guy lied. Nope. It caught me too early. I was running around the edge and all of a sudden he started. Okay, we've hit it like six times now. Yeah. Let me tell you, watching you play this with glasses off, it is such a ride. One. Two. Three, and I can't move now. That's honestly probably for the better. So we know what to do, we'll just four. The crystal. Oh, there we go, seven times. Point being, boss battle is over, and now we get a cutscene. You cannot control the power of Raw. You are nothing. Yeah, heard that before. Hey. You do not comprehend the true power of that crown. You have placed yourself in great peril by retrieving it. You are either very foolish or very brave. But are you the one of the prophecy? We shall see. Take this gold ankh as a reward for your achievements. That's your fourth one. Now, this is one of the special ones. It automatically increases it. I need another one of the other kind and I can add another onk. 
Soon enough, we'll have a full screen full of onks. That would be nice. That would be nice. And that might have made it where I could have beat this game the first time I tried it. It just automatically teleports you back to Anubis. Apparently. Oh, no, it's Emotep. At last you have arrived. I was wondering if you would return at all. I didn't expect such complications in Abydos. It appears that the forces of darkness are moving faster than I anticipated. Naturally. If you had not intervened, I am sure that eventually Abydos would have suffered a similar fate to that of Heliopolis. Now that you have interfered with his plans, the enemy will be watching you more closely, striving harder to hinder your progress. <clears throat> you must be prepared for the more difficult and dangerous journey that lies ahead. I have confidence that you will rise to the challenges that you will face. You should go to Anubis now. He may have information about the enemy that I lack. Use your portal amulet to get to his tower more quickly. Maybe we should stick around and break stuff. Yeah. Is there anything in here to break? No, but I think there's stuff outside the temple. Well, I know there's a save point. Yeah, that's the most important thing. And let's at least save. <clears throat> I'm going to have to quit pretty quick, so I've got to get ready to go this evening. Yeah. That's cool. While you're going, I'll play Saints Row the Third and power myself up. Okay. I almost have unlimited ammo and everything. Yay! Let's go see Anubis and quit. Oh, he wasn't here a second ago. Yeah, he came back. You should take the sacred crown of Abydos to Anubis without delay. Hello. The Anubis amulet. much further in the game because you, there, you have a really interesting scene with Anubis at one point. Ah, you have returned. I was beginning to think the challenge had proved beyond your capabilities. You have my artifact? Ah, this is the one I was thinking of. Yes. So yes. the crown was in the possession of a demon. Hmm, this is indeed an ominous revelation. If Set has attempted to steal the sacred crown of Abydos, then it is certain that he is also seeking the sacred crown of Uruk. He probably already has it. I will stay true to my word. These cursed stones will free more of the inhabitants of the cursed palace. However, you must find the sacred crown of Uruk and return it to me before Set lays his hands on it. These acid darts should help you in your quest for the crown. A Queen's, uh, King's Quest game. Good luck on your new quest. Okay, so the other guy is Set. And this is Anubis. Yes, I knew that. You can dissolve certain metal chains. And we can free two more people in the Cursed Palace. Do you want to do that now or later? Uh, let's see. Uh, what's the fastest way out of here? The Heliopolis thing. Amulet. Heliopolis, Heliopolis portal amulet. Now, let me see where this takes us. I cannot remember. For an entire dungeon. 
Uh, yeah, you're right. That's through an entire dungeon. We're not doing that. Down here. I know, sir. Use item. Heliopolis Angular. This takes us back to the Sun Shrine. Yep. And now we go zoom zoom around the island and see the Cursed Palace. Yeah, we can activate two more Otten statues. Now it's the Sacred Crown of Uruk Anubis is seeking. This obsession with the Sacred Crowns makes me uneasy. I urge caution, Sphinx. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to save and quit. Okay. You might want to put this on the charger. Yeah. <laughs> 